Hey, what's going on guys? It's Two Shot here from Two Shot Gaming. Welcome to the new channel if you're seeing this for the first time. Real quick, I just want to go over a couple things. On the um, top right of the screen, you can follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Twitch TV every Tuesday and Thursday at 7 o'clock live, Eastern Standard Time. And on the bottom here, uh, Two Shot Gaming, please come sub if you're old sub on our old channel. The old channel is going to get deleted, so come check me out. Today we're going to be doing Mod Loader. Mod Loader is a very simple, easy mod to install. You guys just have to take your time. I'll go through it with you step by step. One big thing is that Mod Loader works along with other mods. There are certain ways to do this mod. If you have a certain mod, Mod Loader is not just as simple as dropping the mod in there. In the mods folder and everything's going to work. Sometimes you need other mods. Sometimes you have to install it different. Sometimes you just need Mod Loader in there. So... I always wanted to know how to put Mod Loader in. That's why I started doing all these tutorials. I couldn't find a video just for Mod Loader. So I did it. It did it pretty well. Some guys didn't understand how to do it exactly. So if you are trying to install a mod and um, you need Mod Loader, leave a comment. Tell me what mod you're trying to install. Please don't flip out if you have a problem with it. Because Mod Loader is just a loader. But the mods installed different. Okay? So let's get started. If you need any help, leave comments. Tell me the mod you're trying to install, and I'll help you out. I'll make a video for you, as long as it don't get, you know, too many people. But I'll try my hardest to get to each and every one of these. First thing we're going to do is going to make a backup. This is the backup right here. I made a little file. You just click on your desktop, new folder. It's pretty easy. First thing you want to do down here is you want to backup your files. So you go down here, you do percent app data percent that'll bring you to your Roma file click on that that'll bring you to your dot minecraft double click on that now this is all the stuff that's in your minecraft your dot minecraft what you want to do is open up your backup nice empty folder just how you want it highlight this take this drop it in here okay what I like to do make your little stuff go a little faster very simple mod it's probably definitely gonna work for us with no problems we want to do is copy your last login that'll do all your logins right copy your saves that'll bring over all your worlds all your saves on your worlds and do your service data copy that that's like the only three you can really use if you have any worlds in here I got one world in there doesn't really matter and um as you can see, I got the world in there. Same exact world. So it's still in here, still backed up. Your backups are still here, everything's fine. Alright? Close that. There's your backups. We don't need that no more. We're backed up. Now we have our saves, which is our worlds. I'm sorry if I'm going slow, I just want all you guys to get it. Login is the my username and password. Service data is all the IPs to the server I play the play on. Okay? So next thing you want to do is let's move my load here we want to start up minecraft right the login password is there just like always you start that up it downloads a new jar if you guys can see right behind me the files are being made all the files are back how they were beautiful you get the mojang side you get the minecraft everything's working great right okay so let's move this over here we're gonna need We'll, we'll, we'll leave it here okay and the next thing we want to do is show you real quick this is the mod loader page I'll leave the link in the description of course and you come down here here's a lot of questions so if you have a little troubleshooting problems you can look through these questions it'll help you out a lot and you go right here this is mod loader he has plenty of other mods if you want help installing those leave them down there too if you like any of them I'll be more than happy to help you out with that too you can do either download Airfly or direct download. Either one of those two are great. If you use Airfly, it helps out the guy that makes the mods. Without them, these mods won't be here. So it's very good if you click um, Airfly. But I already have it downloaded because when you hit Airfly, sometimes you get an ad. Nope. That's my new channel, guys, which I have no subs and no views. So if you guys see this, come sub. I'll do more subs I get, the more videos I'll do, guys. Sorry about that. Shameless plug. 
Okay. Now we're in here. We downloaded everything back, right? What you want to do is go into your bin. Your Minecraft.jar. Whatever Minecraft's in here, the regular old Minecraft.jar is the one you want to use. The one that just downloaded. It's the only one you should have in here. If it doesn't say .jar, just use the one that says Minecraft. You want to right click on here. We're using 7 zip today. I'll put the link in the description if you don't have it. It's a free program. You also... Oh, okay. 7 zip, open archiver. And this is your archiver. WinRAR is good too, but unless you pay for it, you always got to add the pops up, and I hate that. It drives me crazy. Okay, what we got here is the whole jar file. The meta in folder. Highlight it. Right click. Delete it. Yes. It's gone. Always has to leave. It can never stay. No matter what, you'll get a black screen. Okay? If you don't have it already, that means you didn't re-download it. Next thing you want to do is open. Well, open that one. It doesn't matter. <clears throat> Drag it over here. These are all the class files from Mod Loader. All you gotta do is highlight these files, take them, drop them in. You hit yes, all the files are transferred. That's Mod Loader. The only way I can show you that it works without putting in another mod, let's do dot Minecraft right there. We start up Minecraft again. Log in. It generates a mod folder. Mod loaded text. Mod loader. This is the only way to really show you that it works. Unless you have another mod in, it's all compatible, it does its thing. Alright guys. Thank you so much for your time. Please remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. It'll be great if you guys start coming back. It's the more you come back, the more videos I'll do, guys. Until next time, later.